Hi, I'm Amanda and I'm not drunk, but I'm a little tipsy and here's how it happened. I am on Negroni numero quattro and it's not that bad because I also had Indian and for some reason Indian actually goes well with Negroni. But here's what it's made out of. It's one part Rosa Amaro, which is like a bitter orange liqueur. Normally Negronis are made with Campari, but I wanted to try something different. And then there is one part Leopold American Gin, which is based out of Colorado. And then one part Sweet Vermouth. You're supposed to shake all those things over ice and then pour it onto a new ice cube, but I didn't do that. But I uh, mixed it all in a glass and then I took a, or what is that? It's an orange peel. Expressed the oil over that, ran the peel. <laughs> Oh my god, over the rim, and um, here we are. And I chose a Negroni because A, it's like Negroni week, but that doesn't matter because who knows when this is going to be published, uploaded, going live. But I just spent a lot of the day watching Searching for Italy and then Big Night. Apparently it was like a Stanley Tucci day here at Shea Casa. Here, a lot of Italy stuff going on, and for me, Negronis are super Italian. Those are Aperol spritzes, but it's like fall-ish, and I kind of feel like the time for Aperol is past, which is stupid. Let's play with some makeup. All right, um, still stressed out. I start my new job next week, but I'm still breaking out, and my eyebrows are being weird, so... We're going to do that. So I want to do a smoky high, smoky high, which I've never really done before. And we're going to attempt a liquid cat eye with it. So send us your blessings. And we're going to get started with the eyes first, just because I feel like there might be some fallout there. So we're going to start with this. And I just love this. It's so cute. Look at it. It's so tiny and little and cool and dark and smoky eye-ish. So first things first is we need clean brushes, but unfortunately I don't have any of those. Oh, here's one. I'm just going to kind of use this light color and lay that down. I normally never do my eyes first, but I also never do anything like really insane, so. It's like I never knew how to do makeup, but I actually never knew how to do makeup, so I don't know what comes next. So I'm just going to take some of this gray shade, this one right here with that same brush, and kind of do that on the outer, outer corner and into the crease. It might be like a cool smoky, like a cool tone smoky eye, I have no idea what I'm doing. I feel like I'm poking my socket. I honestly have no idea what I'm doing. But I don't care because I'm having fun. I get to play with things that I normally don't get to play with because normally in my everyday makeup, I just do like a sheer tint and I don't put any eyeshadow on, do my attempt to do my eyebrows and then mascara and some blush and that's about it. So I also never do eyeliner, so I'm actually surprised that I have a liquid eyeliner in my stash, but here we are. I'm going to take this dark brown shade and kind of put that in the corner of my eye and then blend that out. I'm going to take this black shade in here and then I'm going to use that to eye line my eyes and then try to smoke it out. We'll see how it goes because I don't actually know what a smoky eye looks like. I love makeup and I love makeup tutorials but I guess I don't pay enough attention I kind of always have it on in the background I'm not a makeup artist I don't whatever I just like playing with makeup and I like drinking so I think that I'm using the wrong brush so if we're gonna really smoke it out let's take a bare brush a lot of work and I don't think I was necessarily prepared for it. I don't understand how people could do, can take two and a half hours, four hours to do their makeup. I get irritated after 15. 
So now let's go ahead and blend that out, kind of make everything look like it sort of goes together, but we're not sure. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see how this goes. I've never attempted a cat eye before. I, I, I don't even, what, what is the technique? I kind of want to start with, hey Bobby. Doggy's coming to play. Hello. He thinks I'm ridiculous. That's okay, I do too. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the other eye. I, 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 I don't even, I don't even know where to start. That's, that's really bad. <laughs> it's so bad. with a makeup remover. Let's see how this goes. Yep, that's not going. Maybe it is. Oh, I guess if life goes, gets bad, just put a little makeup remover on it, right? with the other hand. <laughs> this is gonna go so bad. I think this is just turned from like a smoky eye into a simple cat eye but it's not super simple. But it's like it's a nice little wing it's just it's really shiny. Okay let's let's try the other eye. Those are wildly <laughs> so uneven holy shit oh my god and I'm like really I just have a completely different look than what I set out to do I'm just gonna sit here and make it worse <laughs> <laughs> that's so bad oh my god okay whatever we're gonna we're gonna move. do an under layer of everything so just fix that up So we're just going to blend this. <laughs> Can you hear my dog walking in? He's getting really restless. He's ready to go out. It's about 9.30 at night and it's time for his evening walk. But he's going to have to wait for me. He's such a good patient dog. I'm going to take some contour. <laughs> and this is probably way too dark, but that's why we're putting it underneath so that we can kind of blend in the foundation. I can't get over how heavy my eyeliner is. I feel like I should have a cigarette and my eyes should be more bloodshot. I've got the drinking, but I'm missing everything else. And so I forgot to put on primer. It's right here. the eyeballs like I think everything else is kind of fine but I don't know I've also had a few of these to drink I feel like I need another one I just kind of kind of wish that I had um, put on primer but you know I forget things when I'm uh, when I've been in my cups which is a Shakespearean term so if you're here for anything that's not pretentious I'm sorry you've come to the wrong place I think that looks pretty nice. I'm a little pale, so let's go ahead and warm it up with some bronzer. Oh, such 
suddenly I look like I've been in the sun. I forgot to put on powder. But I'm going to make myself another drink, so I'll be right back. You know, I used to not like Negroni. I think the first Negroni I ever had, it wasn't made very well, and so I just was not into it. And um, I'm glad that it wasn't until I made it myself, and like I had the Rosomaro, and then I also had the Campari, and I've tried both of them, and I just, I like the way that I make them. So, I want to go ahead and put on some highlighter, and I happen to just grab a highlighter willy-nilly. It's going to... Ooh, I just want to look like a beach. That's all I want in life. Oh, that's a lot. Now I look dirty. Now I'm going to go ahead and powder. I like a really matte look. I'm not into looking dewy or anything. Um, now we're going to take some blush. Okay, and now we should probably complete the smoky eye. So we're going to go back into the, the eyeshadow palette. I'm using the wrong tools for everything. Oh no. Because I'm using the wrong tools and I'm just not paying attention. Let's attempt brows. And I hate doing my brows. And also at this point it doesn't really matter. So there are people who spend like 10 minutes on their brows. I would never ever want to spend that long on my brows. Alright, we're almost done. If I could perfect the cat eye though, I think that'd be really cool. I just, I need to not be so heavy handed on the top. Oh, lips. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and line my lips. And then some lippy stick. And that softens it right up. And then I'm gonna go ahead and spray my face with some setting spray. Oh, oh, that's really chunky. Oh, yep, yeah, see right there. Probably because I haven't used this one in a while. So we're just gonna kind of set that in. I'm a little bit more shiny than I'd like, but that's fine. Uh, and then we're gonna go ahead and do the eyelashes. Out. Make sure you don't get your lid in there. So we're just gonna just a lot of mascara on. This is a lot. This is a lot. <laughs> oh boy. No, I really, I feel like I should have like a really husky voice. Like it sounds like I've been smoking for 27 years. This is the finished look. So, I'm really glad that I don't get paid, to, that I don't get paid to do this. Because uh, this is, um, this is a look. Yeah, yeah. All right. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for being here. If you like it, give this video a big thumbs up. If you don't, please send it to someone that you don't like so you can share something that might make their day worse. We'll see you next time. Ciao. Dozer. What do you think of this look? Bad, right? Bad. All right. Do you want to go for a walk? <laughs>